Hello everyone, we are from True Maths and in this video we are going to solve the second part of question number 10. And in this, again a triangle ABC and EFG is given to you and though these two triangles are similar, here DC is the angle bisector of angle C and here GH is the angle bisector of angle H, angle G sorry. And angle bisector means this line is dividing this angle in equal two parts. Here also this line is dividing angle G in equal two parts. And in this case you have to prove that triangle DCB is similar to triangle HGE. And here this DCB this is the first triangle and you have to prove that this triangle is similar to triangle this HEG this one. Now if you want to prove that this these two triangles are similar for that what you need to do is you need to prove that two angles of this triangle are equal to two angles of this triangle and for that we'll use this thing where this complete triangle is given similar to this complete triangle means if this complete triangle is similar to this complete triangle means all three angles of this triangle must be equal to all three angles of this triangle because triangle ABC is given similar to triangle EGF this is given to you and if these two are similar means this angle must be equal to this angle so angle B must be equal to angle E now in these two triangles in this first triangle this angle is equal to this angle and similarly angle C must be equal to angle G here and this complete angle must be equal to this complete angle and now because this is dividing this angle means if angle is this is X this must also be X similarly if this is Y uh, sorry this is the, these are the same angles so th if this is X this must also be x. Now this complete is 2x. So if I have to write this angle, so this must be half of this complete angle. Similarly, this must also be the half of this complete angle because this angle is x and this complete angle is of 2x. So this is half of this. So for that I have to divide this by 2 and Half of angle C is basically this angle and this angle can be written as DCB. So angle DCB must be equal to half of angle G and half of angle G is this one and this can be written as HGE. This must be equal to HGE. So this is the first and this is the second equation where we have proved that this angle is equal to this angle and this angle is equal to this angle. So in this triangle we have proved that two angles are equal to two angles of this triangle. So by angle angle property we can say that triangle this DCB is similar to triangle HGE. This we can confirm by angle angle property and similarity so this is how you can solve this second part also if you like this video please subscribe to our channel and if you have any problem in maths you can directly contact to us the phone number and the email address and the whatsapp number is given below in the description thank you